Hello there, let's talk today about the white skin version 3 when the red light stays on. That's not normal. As you can see here, I have a blue. So basically, when the camera boots up, you can see the red light, but it needs to change to steady blue. Let me just disconnect the camera and connect again here so you can see that. So basically, unplug the camera and plug it back. Here we go. You see at first the red light, right? but uh, it needs to change to blue one, like a uh, flashing blue, and finally the steady blue, you see? Right now, it's changing to blue, it's flashing, it's trying to connect to the Wi-Fi, because I already have the camera set up with my cell phone, so it's basically working here, and now it's steady blue. If the light here is red, steady red, something is wrong with, with your camera. Uh, if the camera is being updated with the firmware update, you're gonna see red. If the camera is booting up, you're gonna see red, but not when the camera is ready to work, right? So what I have to do here is the first thing is try to reboot the camera. So you restart the camera, just like I did. The second thing is check the cable. Make sure you're using the correct cable. Here I have the cable from WISE, the original one. Make sure you have the original one or try a different one, okay? That's the second thing you can do. And you can also plug to a different outlet. Perhaps you already tried that, but make sure you already did. You try to connect to a different outlet. And finally, you need to do the factory reset, okay? Most of the time that solves the problem. Factory reset and also remove the SD card. And then if it works, when you reset, then you can try use a different SD card as well. So to reset the camera is very easy. Let me just show you how it works here. So basically here you get the camera and here on the back, you have the reset button. Here we go. You have the SD card and the reset button, okay? Or the setup button. So what you can do first is just disconnect your cable from power. Okay, come here to the SD card. And sometimes it's a little bit hard to open it. Here we go. Then we remove the SD card. Okay, remove it here. Uh, here we go. Just remove it. And then here is the setup button. Then you can reset your camera, okay? I have another video here in the channel that I show how to reset it. But basically, you just need to press and hold here to reset, it, right? Let me just do this right now. Let me just grab the cable again. Just drop it. So here we go. Connecting here again. And pressing the reset button. Connect. Then you hear the message, ready to connect. So now you know that's reset. Here you see that's flashing, red. Right now the camera is ready to connect it, then you just need to use your cell phone and add the camera again as you did on the first connection, right? And then you're ready to go. Then you can try a different SD card later. Don't use the SD card at first, try it later. So try only when you have the steady blue here again, when you connect to your Wi-Fi, right? So basically here, when you try to connect again, you just need to come here to your app, here we go, I have the camera here, but it's not working now. So I'm just remove it from here. Come here and delete the device. So let me just click here, add a new device. Cameras, wide scan version three. A heart ready to connect. Here, select my Wi-Fi. Just remember to select uh, 2.4 because two, uh, five gigahertz is not supported for, for this camera. So I just need to come here and select a different Wi-Fi network. Come here, select a 2.4 one that I have here. My router has five and 2.4. Okay, so just make sure that you have 2.4. Come back here, enter your password and next. Now it needs to read the QR code. Let me just put it here that way. QR code. 
the QR code was scanned. Here is the message as well. Next. Now it's connecting, right? Well, basically resetting the camera and starting over. Setup yeah. completed. They need to name my device. Let's just put something here like baby can, whatever. Continue. Continue here. Almost there. Just take some time. It's loading something here. Then I skip some steps here and just finish. And here you go. My camera back working here. Pretty fine. Okay. It's working now. Okay, guys. So basically, that's the way it works. You just need to try to test your cable, power cycle the camera, plug to a different outlet, and also factory reset without the card. And later, you can insert your SD card again. So here I have it. And you insert it again there and you set up your camera to record again, right? So I hope that helps. Please subscribe to this channel, leave your thumbs up and your comments, and I see you in the next one.